What's going on, beautiful Reds Mafia? I hope you guys are doing great tonight. It's the day after Christmas. Went all through the house. Not Nothing is stirring, not even a mouse. But my Shiner Bach and Old Red is stirring because I'm itching to get my Carson's Rodizio lit back up again. And somebody had mentioned, hey Red, I want to see you do Costella, which are ribs, on your Carson Rodizio. So tonight, what you're gonna see are baby back ribs, chicken wrapped in bacon or frango con bacon, and on my Rodizio, all on my Yoder, everything is fired up downstairs, ready to rock and roll. I'm gonna show you how I prepare the ribs, the chicken, and let's get to it right now, guys. I hope you guys are enjoying stuff like this. If you are, please join Old Red in this journey of love, family, passion, and barbecue, and subscribe. It's free, and I want you to join me on this great journey that we're having a great time at, guys. Cheers to all of y'all out there. Don't forget to hit that like button, y'all. Smash that monkey like you meant it. So the first thing that we're gonna do, I've already got this one prepared and ready to go. Let's take a quick look at this. The first thing that I do, is I look for any bone spurs, and there's none here. I also look for meat that flaps off because on the Rodizio, if it flaps, it's going to burn. So I simply make a nice cut all the way around. I'll get some of that fat off in just one second, but before we do that, let's take off this membrane. And if you've never taken off a membrane before, what you do is you find a bone, you stick a butter knife into the bone, and then you kind of work it around until you start getting some space. Just like that. Once you get space, you can put some fingers in there. Grab a paper towel. Grab it with your paper towel so it doesn't slip. Start raising up nice and neat. There we go. Some days we get really lucky and we get it all in one shot. You want to take that membrane off because that seasoning is going to play an important key whenever we put these on, put the seasoning on the ribs uh, with the membrane off because it's going to allow for more penetration. So here is a lot of nuanced uh, meat. So what we'll do is we'll just make a nice easy, we're not taking off much, just the part to make it all nice and dangly, get that off, trim these up just a little bit. There's usually some fat right along here that I tend to take off a little bit as well. Just like that. That easy. And it's just a tiny, tiny bit. And that is all we need. So now what we're going to do is we're going to season these bad boys up. Let's make a nice coating here. I'm using Cosmos Q, Dirty Bird. Get beautiful color. Look at that, that's just gonna be just gorgeous. Great flavor. Cosmos is one of the absolute best rubs I've ever used. I use them all the time and generally pat it down just to make sure we get it in there because we're gonna flip it over. If you have time, let this tack up for about a minute to two minutes. That way you don't lose any. Just like that little bit that fell over right there. Now let's go ahead and get this front side seasoned up and then let's get it on the skewer and then let's get to our frango con bacon and these will be some of the quickest ribs you've ever done if you don't have a Carson's Rodizio take a look down below and in my show more description box and you're gonna see where you can get this stuff from and I am a brand ambassador for uh, Carson Rodizio. So if you do click on that link and you do wind up getting something, that will let uh, Blake know that, hey, Red's doing a good job of throwing my stuff out there. So I would definitely be appreciative if that's something that you would do, if you wanna buy. So here, what we're gonna uh, do is take our skewers, simply skewer every few bones. All right, there we go. There we go. 
Just like that. Beautiful. Now that I've done that one, I'll go ahead and do the other one and we'll get right back with you guys. Very simple. What we have here are chicken breasts. Straight out of the package. Now we're gonna cube them up in nice, probably two by two cuts, so they're nice and thick. And we're also gonna trim up a lot of this fat now that we're ready to rock and roll or just pull it off. Now that we have all of our cubes here ready to go, we're gonna take our beautiful dirty bird from Cosmos Cube and get these birds dirty. There we go. Get all that good rub, all that good rub, all over. Let's start rolling. Cut it in half. Make sure whenever you're doing this, you're make you're putting the uh, skewer right through the ends of one of the pieces of bacon, so that it stays on and doesn't flap around. All right, we got eight on here, which is good enough. All right, so I'm gonna get to the rest of these and then what we're gonna do is take it downstairs, put it on and get to cooking. And I just went to Ace Hardware today, saw my buddy Ricky and I picked up some B&B lump charcoal with mesquite and I wanted to give it a test. I've never used it and let's see how she works out. They say it's the best and I will put it to the test guys. Thank you so much, smash that like button and we'll be right back y'all. What's up y'all? It's just old me, the Rodizio, and you tonight. Thank you for joining me. We are almost done. We are just over an hour, one hour and 10 minutes to be exact. Let me show you because I've been moving them around from, from the bottom to the top, top to bottom, left, right. Give me one, give me five, give me two, give me two, give me one, give me one. So, some good food. So, why don't you guys take a quick turkey peek at this. Let's see what we got and let's get ready to rumble! Good, yeah. it look good, it looks good. How about you? That's what you call a meat board. So as you guys can see, 
a half a pan's worth of B&B uh, hard lump mesquite charcoal, the green bag, and I went through probably one and a half of those in just over an hour. So I've got a whole lot of cooking left on that thing. I think B&B is a winner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Thanks for joining me tonight, guys. Today was a really quick cook. I ran over to Ace Hardware in Fairfax, the twins, Ace Hardware. Looked up my boy, Ricky, who helped me out very much. So thank you so much, Ace Hardware and uh, Ricky, and uh, get some of this great food. This is the baby back cooked on the uh, Carson Rodizio. Mm. That Cosmo, Rub is just phenomenal. This is the reason why I use this on everything. Dirty bird, baby. Dirty bird, you're dirty. You're so dirty. Mmm. Good job, Darren. Chicken wrapped in bacon, little nuggets of gold. Mmm. So juicy. Of course, veggies. For the win, Blake. Thank you so much. Thanks, honey. Thanks, Carson Rodizio, for always believing me, supporting me. Thank you, Cosmos, for hooking me up. I appreciate all of you out there, all of Red's Mafia. Much love. Remember, hit subscribe, hit like. Red loves you. And remember, life is about love, family, passion, and barbecue, y'all. Peace!